let's see if I can do this. I'm unboxing another thing of Shane. I should say unbagging. <laughs> and I don't want to show my address. And they put it on both sides of the bag this time. So let's open the baggie. And then I'll put it to the side. And then I'll dig stuff out of it. <laughs> All right. Let's take a look. This, can you see my all right <laughs> I got a new phone tripod and like I don't know you know I don't know I don't know if I like it I don't know if I know how to use it yet <laughs> um but okay this is the first thing very excited for this it's so soft Ooh. okay so it's like a hairband and it's got the little bow on it this one doesn't have the bow with, um, uh, whatchamacallit, what's that called? Um, some of them have little wires in them so that you can like wrap a ponytail in them. Uh, this one doesn't have any wires in the bow. It's just a cute little headband so that I could get my hair out of my face while I do my makeup. So that's, that's pretty cute. Oh, I already feel some fuzz coming out of it. <laughs> oh, well. You know, it was, I don't know, it was very cheap. It was like three dollars. Three dollars. Put this over here. All right, what else do we got? This is a, a little wallet, like a little pocketbook, I think. Ooh, I make it so much noise. Oh, cute. Very nice. So normally I've been using an Ipsy bag to hold my little wallet stuff. This is an upgrade, I should say. The Ipsy bags are very nice, right? But um, you know, the, the one I'm using, little tassels and stuff, everything is frayed on it. So this is just very cute. Um, excited to get this in my purse. Let's make the snap snap. Can I can I do it? Okay, there we go. There's no magnetic snap on that, so it's a little difficult for me. Oh, this is adorable. So I don't need another purse, but this was so beautiful. This is like my favorite color, and I just couldn't help myself. Couldn't help myself, and it was very it's cheap. Maybe this is the most expensive thing in here in this whole order and it must have been I don't know maybe 14 bucks oh and it comes with its own little wallet I didn't realize I guess I didn't realize that it comes with its own little oh very cute but this color is so nice um it's obviously not real leather you know but it's it's nice it's soft it's not like all the the of the zipper works, you know, like what, can, what more can a girl ask for? It comes with a little strap. Let's clip that on. Okay. Nice. It even has an extender on the strap so you can make it as long or as short as you want it. This is nice. Let's get the little airbag out of it. <laughs> Um, okay, nice. It doesn't have any inner pockets. It's just one big pocket, but like, who cares, right? And this is adorable, this little attachment. Oh, cute. All right, I'm putting this in here. So cute. So cute and so pretty, right? I love this color green. Love it. Um, all right, let's try one of these. Oh, this one's actually falling out. I got keychains. Another thing, I just, I don't necessarily need it, but oh, they were so cute and so cheap. All right, let's look at this one. <laughs> it comes with a, a jump ring, you know, or whatever this is called to actually put your keys on it. Um, but then it also comes with a clip, so it's very easy to get on and off of a purse. I like these little, like, see 
clips, lobster clips maybe they're called. And look at the little kitty faces. And a little paw. And the back of them is just gold. That's nice, you know? You know what? <laughs> it kind of smells like metal. Like that cheap metal. It probably won't be good if it ever gets wet in the rain or whatever. But, you know, for that price. And you wash your hands every time that you, you know, you touch your keys anyway. You get home, you touch your keys, you, you know, you wash your hands, right? So it doesn't really matter that it smells a little metally. Um, these, I'm excited for these. These are earrings. Uh, I do have a thing for cats, but I've always had a thing for bunnies. And let's just look at these for a second. Those are so cute, so cute. Um, also, let me make sure I put these back in the bag. Um, I hate it when earring backs have these little plastic things on them. So my sister-in-law, she actually showed me a trick. Um, if you put this metal piece down on the table and push, push the, well, maybe I shouldn't do it on the, this wooden table. Um, and if you push the edge of the plastic, you should be able to pop the plastic piece off of the, maybe not on these, holy moly, that's really in there. Um, <laughs> but I'm just bending the plastic right now. I have a ton of backings anyway, but yeah, uh, if you're like me and you don't like, it's getting there. I think it's, the table and I, I feel like I'm breaking the uh <laughs> I'm pushing too hard into the the wood grain um but yeah if you don't like the plastic pieces around your your posts you can definitely pop the metal piece out you just have to go up this way okay um yeah if you ever want to try I could try to um I could try to videotape that <laughs> in a little you know, at a later date when I'm on a different table. All right, what else we got here? Oh, okay, all right. This is a, this is for my kitchen. Thought this was a good idea. I've seen some influencers use this on their cooking shows. It's a little grinder, like an extruder uh, for garlic or, you know, whatever else you wanna put in there. You put your something in there and you smoosh it down. It's very nice. I like that. You, I guess butter, garlic, whatever. That seems like a good purchase and it was cheap. What else is in here? Oh. I'm, I don't think I'm gonna open these right now because I need to wash them all. Um, but they look like nice quality. They're, um, they're plastic little containers with tops. And it comes with a label set for spices. Um, which is awesome because in my kitchen, like, the very cheapest spice you can get are in those little packages. I think it's called Tempico or something is the brand. Um, and it's just like a plastic bag. And it's very hard to get the spices out, like, in a small amount or whatever. So I figured I would like just use those and create my own little containers um, for the spices. I think that's very nice. Let's put this off to the side. And I'll probably show you in a separate video. <laughs> what else we got? Oh, this is another keychain. This is another keychain. Uh, rabbits. Oh, there's two. I guess I thought they were on the same ring, but there's a little bunny and a little carrot. How cute. Let me put those with my kitties. And... Alright, I don't think I have too, too much stuff left in here. It's definitely not my whole order. <laughs> Um, but this is a mat, one of those, um, like a foot mat for when you get out of the shower. I guess I also thought that maybe I'd put it in the kitchen because it's, it's got a nice, um, 
grip to it. And it also has, let me rip this tag off. I hate, I hate it when tags on carpets will come out. Um, but it's very nice. And if you could see the, it's not like too thick. It's not very thick, um, but it's plushy. It's very soft. And I think it'd be nice under your feet when you're cooking, if you're standing a lot and stuff like that. So very nice. Um, so yeah, I think that was the first batch of stuff. I have some more things coming uh, because I definitely wanted to try out some of the Sheen wigs. Um, so yeah, I gotta check online to see where when the other stuff is coming. And I'll let you know when I put together my spice rack. That'd be super cute, right? Um, all right, well, thanks for watching me open these things. Uh, and if you have any questions about any of the things or want links or product numbers or, you know, how pricey things were, um, just ask me in the comments and I'll, I'll totally get back to you. I have all the information. Um, all right. Bye. <laughs>